Hey Virgo, welcome to your weekend energy check. We're going to go ahead and check on your energy for the weekend. This is a mini read. So we're going to see what is going on around you guys for this weekend in regards to love. Virgo, please keep in mind that these are short readings. So if this reading resonates for you and you would like additional messages and clarity regarding your situation, you can always book a personal reading with me. The information is in the description box below. What is this overall energy here for my Virgo for this weekend? What is going on with Virgo? In regards to love universe. Wow. So, oh, okay, Virgo. You might be going out this weekend. Having fun. Celebrating. New opportunities. New beginnings. Um, a rather large social event. And you're going to end up meeting somebody who is sweet. Somebody who is sexy. Somebody who is passionate. Virgo, you're going out and you're not looking for love. And all of a sudden, love is going to come towards you, okay? This Knight of Wands energy, I'm sorry, Knight of Cups energy is just going to gallop into your energy. Going to come right in out of nowhere. And someone's about to shake the ground that you walk on, my love. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What is this overall energy for Virgo for the weekend? What's going on with them? You got the sun in the reverse. Virgo, I feel like you just recently got out of a situation. You could have been dealing with the Leo. And it left you in this very sad, drained energy. You've been experiencing some delays. You possibly even tried to date other people. But to you, you just you weren't happy. Nobody was really calling your attention or drawing you in. But I feel like this weekend you're going to meet someone at some type of social event. Possibly a water sign energy here. And this person is going to come in out of nowhere. Very, very unexpected type of energy here. Hangman energy in the reverse. This person is going to help you see things clearly for what they are. You will no longer feel stuck. This person is going to be a rather spiritual individual as well, I feel. And with this King of Pentacles energy, someone who is very stable and grounded. Okay. Universe, Archangel, Spirit, Angel, Guides, and Guardians. What is this overall energy? Six of Wands in the reverse. So, Virgo, I do suggest that you give this relationship the opportunity it deserves. Don't start claiming um, negative energy before you get the opportunity to really get to know this person because you are going to rob yourself of this nine of cups energy. Okay. So when you meet this person, receive this new situation with open arms and really get to know where this person's coming from. Cause you're going to be very surprised when you meet this individual six of pentacles energy. You're actually going to be very surprised because you're going to be like, Somebody who you never expected to come into your life is going to come in and is going to bring in a lot of balance for you. And they're going to be a very supportive individual and a very financially stable one at that. Okay. So judgment energy, please, please don't judge a book by its cover. Okay. Really get to know this person for who they are. Because I got to be honest with you guys. The more you release this blocked off energy, the more you're going to feel like this relationship is an equal relationship, is a stable relationship, and there was a reason why this new person was presented to you. Release the past. Let it go. It's a done deal. You walked away from it already. It's time for you to really enjoy your life for what it is, okay? Don't worry about the betrayal because there is no betrayal on this connection. I feel like you're still carrying the betrayal from the past and you are being told to let it go. Work on that. Work on that because this person that you're going to meet, they're going to be worth your while, okay? All right, guys. I hope and pray that this gave you some clarity and I'll talk to you guys soon. Take care.